A woman's desperation growing tonight to find her sister who's been missing for weeks after leaving a Grain Valley nightclub. New at 10, Brindley's Gonzalez spoke with Amber Couch's sister and shows us her effort to find her sister. Amber's sister lives in Nebraska and says they talk at least once a month, but she hasn't heard from her since December, and now she's joined police in a search that so far has left very few clues. The last time Amber Couch called her sister Angela Trent was Christmas. It was just normal conversation. Um, she had wanted to know about our grandma because she was adopted. Um, and I mean, that was pretty much it. Amber was most recently living in Oak Grove with her four year old daughter. Now, more than a month since a 28 year old has been spotted by anyone. I'm not ready to accept that she's gone. Um, I still have hope that she is out there somewhere. This is the last image of Amber taken at the Whiskey Tango in Grain Valley on January 19th. Moments after this video surveillance was taken, Amber stepped out into this parking lot to hand her friend some money. After that, she went back inside, and that's the last time anyone's heard from her. It's not like her to be this gone this long from her daughter. Grain Valley police have few leads. It's very frustrating because we just don't we don't know where to go. This week, police found her car in Lenexa. Police Chief Aaron Ambrose says Amber has disappeared before, but always kept in touch with her daughter. Not this time. I mean, that, that's the biggest sign to me that this isn't good. Hundreds of miles away, her sister Angela continues her own search. <laughs> it's very frustrating. She started a Facebook page and placed yellow ribbon all around her home and car. Because the yellow ribbon stands for missing. And yeah, they're staying up there until she's found. Angela is coming to Kansas City this weekend to post flyers and do her own searching. Grain Valley Police urge anyone with tips or leads to contact them or call the tips hotline. Live in the studio, Brenda Lee Gonzalez, 41 Action News.